Good day everyone, welcome to another lecture video. I am Marika and I will be your teacher for today. I would like to start this lecture with today's lesson objectives. At the end of the lesson, the student should be able to 1. Differentiate commission and cash basis from commission and installment basis. 2. Solve problems involving commission earned in a cash basis and installment basis. And 3. Appreciate the importance of solving problems related to buying and selling through formulating real-life problems. I hope that you acquire these lessons objectives. But before we begin with our discussion, let me ask you first. What do you think is commission? Do you think there is a type of commission? And lastly, in what situations can we encounter the word commission? Please pause this video as you write your answers on your notebook. Time's up! Now, let's move forward. Commissions A commission is a fee that a business pays to a salesperson in exchange for his or her services in facilitating or completing a sale. The amount of commission a salesperson may receive will depend on the structure of the underlying commission agreement. In commission, what do we need to know? What terminology do we have to remember? Well, in calculating commission, we take on these terms. First is the commission rate. It is a percentage or fixed payment associated with a certain amount of sale. For example, a commission could be a 5% of the sales or 45 pesos for each sale. Second, commission and cash basis. It is a commission earned from cash sales taken as a percentage regardless of the time. Then we have commission and installment basis which is the commission earned from installment sales and is based on monthly amortization. While in amortization, it is a periodic repayment of a debt, principal, and interest by means of a sequence of equal periodic payments due at the end of equal intervals of time. To solve commission, it is equal to total sales amount multiplied by commission rate. Take note as that commission rate is a percentage or fixed payment. Here are some examples on solving commissions. Carmen Yambao is a sales agent for the High Ace Realty. She is paid based on commission only. She is given a 2% commission on her sales. For the current month, her sale was 1,035,000 pesos. Her commission would be since commission is equal to total sales amount multiplied by commission rate, we multiply 1,035,000 by 0 0.02 which is 2%. It will then give us a product 20,907. Therefore, Carmen's commission would be 20,907 pesos. Another one, assuming a sale of 120,000 pesos, which is paid in monthly installment of 10,000 pesos. The commission is based on the 10,000 pesos made by the buyer. If the commission paid is 3%, the monthly commission would be... Now here, we multiply 10,000 by 3% commission rate, which is 0 0.03 in decimal form, which is then equal to 300. Therefore, the monthly commission would be 300 pesos. Now, try answering the following problem on your notebook and remember to pause this video as you solve. Anna is working as a sales agent paid with a commission of 6% rate. If a buyer pays 15,000 pesos a month for a 6-month installment, how much is her total commission? To answer that, we multiply 15,000 by 0 0.06 which is equal to 900. It is the monthly commission. But since it is paid for 6 months as installment, then we should multiply 900 by 6 to get her total commission which is 5,400. Therefore, Anna's total commission is 5,400 pesos. Did you get the correct answer? Very good! 
Now let's try another one. Again, remember to pause the video after the problem was given. Roger works as a sales agent for the hardworking trading and earns a basic monthly salary of 8,000 pesos plus a 5% commission on all his sales. If he made a total sale of 50,000 pesos for the month, find his first commission, second gross earnings. Did you get the correct answers? Outstanding! Now, since you have answered the previous problems correctly, let's further evaluate your understanding with the lesson. Just comment down your answers on this video. Ping bought a brand new washing machine worth 16,500 pesos. She will pay it on a straight monthly basis for 10 months. Her sales agent was given a 7% commission. Now find how much is her monthly amortization. How much is the monthly commission of the agent? What is the total commission of the agent? Also, create one example situation involving a commission, then solve and show your solution. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and see you in the next video lectures. Bye-bye.